I also want to thank another person who has made many, many appearances here, and this is his last one here today, at least on this kind of radio. Evil Dave Letterman. I'm doing the Dave Letterman show tonight. Good morning, Howard. How, How are you, you, Dave? Can I? Can I? Uh, Dave, I'm excited about doing your show tonight. I, I appreciate that. Are, are you nervous? No, I told you I'm not. Yes, that's good. And it's nice of you to do our show this morning. Thank you very much. All right, I just want to ask you, can I have a, a sexy uh, sleepover with Ralph? Because I want to see what Sam Simon is getting. <laughs> well, <laughs> Dave, who knows? You know, uh, you're coming by tonight, huh? Yeah. yeah. You, yeah. Not I, you, I, Dave. I, I know you. I won't be able to stay up and see it. So if I just go with you, I'll yeah. see what you did. Day 5.30? Yeah, 5.30. By the way, I want to ask you something, Howard. Yeah. Is, is it true that, that your father is hung like a horse? Because I'd like a peek. Is, is really? My dad? Your, yeah, my dad horse? is. Yeah. Are you trying to tell us you're gay, Dave? You want to sleep with Ralph? Yeah. Is, is that Howard's secret? Is that what he's holding off? No, it's yours. Oh, okay. <laughs> Howard, you know, I have a secret I wanted to share with you. Go ahead, Dave. Well, you know, here's, here's an interesting uh, bit of information. You know, I heard that uh, Cheryl Swoops of the WNBA admits to being a dyke. Hey, Robin, you got anything you want to say before satellite? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not you admitting something. Why don't you say oh, something? Yeah, you want to admit. I don't yeah, get it. What, what, yeah. what, 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 Dave, what, what, Dave, Dave, talking to that microphone and admit it. Well, I, 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 I know, you know, I, I know for a fact that uh, that Jay Leno called Mike Wallace a, a pock-faced heeb. Is, is that the kind of thing you're looking for? <laughs> I didn't know that. That's Only good. telling on others. Well, tell a secret. Himself. Tell a secret about yourself, Dave. That uh, that the audience. A secret about myself. A secret about yourself that the audience say something outrageous that the audience might might uh, be titillated by. I, 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 I raped a kitty and then killed it. <laughs> and, and, and periodically, the Ed Sullivan Theater has to be defrosted. All That's right. About it. Thank you. <laughs> you have no idea. All right, I'll, I'll work something out. Thanks. Penny, okay. Penny, listen, yeah. just, just get your lips off the phone and, and on my ass where it belongs, all right? <laughs> Howard, don't worry about it. I'll take care well, of it. You Thank you, Dave. To... Don't you have some mail to deliver, Evil Dave? Uh, Listen, let me, let me tell you something, Dave. buddy. I've been having a hard time concentrating at work lately because there's an employee who walks around showing off uh, their huge, voluptuous, double-D breasts. His name is Vinny Vavali, and his breasts are massive. I'll take care of it for you, Howard. Don't worry about it. <laughs> thank you. All right, thank you, Vinny. Well, now i got a problem. No one told me it's 4.30. Yes, well, somebody on your end definitely uh, yeah. dropped the ball. Hour. No, here's here's a whole hour of commercials. Yeah. You bore me, pretty boy. I, I can't take it anymore. Damn it, Tom. <laughs> hit the dump button. I'm going to whip out my junk and talk dirty to Fred. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Leave the man alone. David, why don't you talk like that on your show? Huh? I don't understand. Well, because you probably censored me. <laughs> well, I'm not there censoring your show, though. Huh? They were bringing Tom to censor. Well, me. let's not get less mad at us, shall we? I, I, I'm, I'm all for that. <laughs> Yeah. Howard, Howard, can I just say what something? What is it, Dave? My, my wallet's missing. I want every person of color on your staff searched immediately. <laughs> All right, listen, Dave. I'm looking forward to doing your show. Right, I'll try and get there on time. All right, well, don't worry about it. I'll take care of Vinny. Go uh, on. Yeah, just vamp until he gets there. Yeah. Howard, well, Howard yes, Dave. from now on, I want you to call me faggot. Me and a bunch of my uh, fellow uh, gays are, are taking uh, the word over and making it cool. Kind of like the blacks did with the N-word. You know what I'm saying? So you're taking over that word, and you're going to make it like a hip word. I'll take care of Tubby for you, by the way, tonight. Don't All worry right. about it. Thank you, Dave. Like Yo Faga yeah. or something like that? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Dave Letterman, uh, you've been doing our show for so many years. Yeah. And I thank you for that. Howard, will you do me a favor? Let, let me uh, tongue kiss you just once. Come over here. Don't be such a faggot. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> no, thanks. <laughs> Take your mask off. Has, it's radio. You know, Howard, I can't wait to go over to, uh, and say Gary's breath smells like uh, horse ass. I'd say the S word. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We're looking forward to that. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> what is that? I think that might that's be a that's goose. A goose? You're out of your I mind. I remember one of them was a goose. I think. <laughs> the rape. That's Lindo and Mavis, Howard. <laughs> Leno and Mavis. Exactly. <laughs> you know, Howard, I, I'm getting myself hot watching Fred work those sound effects. Hey, pal, use your fingers on me, and I'll make some sounds you'll never forget. <laughs> oh, by the way, Fred, there's a pink mushroom coming out of my zipper. <laughs> <laughs> Howard? Yeah. You know, I, I know some guys that say Pan Am, Pam Anderson is a 10, but I, I sure know some guys who say she charges 20. Why do you want to try that again? Yeah, forget know, it. We get I, it. I was going to say it was such know, a good line too. Yeah. I, I know some guys, you know. No, I I know some guys who say Pam Anderson is a ten, but I also know some guys say she charges twenty. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> we should thank Dave as Dave the guy. You know, yes. you know. Right now, we should blow the cover. Uh huh. Whether Dave. this is not really the real Dave Letterman. <laughs> it's the guy who does. And, and we should thank Dave. He we has should. been wondering. And we should ask him some stuff about who the real Dave is. Yeah, ask him. <laughs> no, we <Okay>. shouldn't. <laughs> so, I, I, I got a couple of questions. Height, weight, that kind of thing. What do you want to know? No, well, first of all, it's it's really interesting. I know that you're dying to go see the David Letterman show today. Yeah. But you've asked people who don't even have any <laughs> chance of getting a ticket. I mean, you've asked the janitor if he could help get you in. That's right. <laughs> I mean, you can only you only have to ask one person. It's called networking, Gary. <laughs> Oh, right. well, we want to thank you. But you know, another question I wanted to ask? What was the other question? The question is, you know, every time you come here, yeah. and, and graciously, you know, we bring you in and we love having you. I appreciate it. You always ask for probably around, I don't know, five to six autograph pictures. And I was just curious, this isn't a, in a bad way, yeah. but what do you do with all the autograph pictures? Like, who do they go to? I, I put them in my house to keep the devil out. No, no, really. Yeah. You, you, I mean, <laughs> do, you, do you barter with them? or huh? I mean, who do they go to? Oh, just, just friends of mine at work. Sometimes. Because it's a lot. I mean, you yeah, they love Howard. They love Howard a lot. It must be a big place. Well, and do you go they around? Love him, they love him a lot. He's the greatest. All right. Yes. Well, thank you. And thank you. You are. And it's the a greatest. good thing I do for him. Right. See how different he sounds when he's being. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right. We have, Dave Letterman is here, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. It was, it was, it was right. a mistake to go talk to the real <laughs> Don't take down the Gary, curtain. Gary, TV or not, do me a favor and and please just put your burka on, please. Oh, Gary. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Howard, can I just say something? Yeah. You know, I, I sure miss the days when, when Gary Delabante's uh, ass was big and dumpy. And, and that new uh, firm little rear of his uh, doesn't fit that busted face. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yeah. God, I, I miss 9111. That was, that was a special day. 9111? <laughs> yeah. 911. Yeah. 911. <laughs> <laughs> Dave Letterman, I'll be on his show tonight. <laughs> he makes you cry, doesn't he, Art? God. How Did I change my favorite moment in the history of the show? <laughs> <laughs> What, Dave, what were you trying to say? I was going to say, can, can you give me a hand over here? I, I've got a tick on my balls. <laughs> All right. Why don't you go chill for a second? Scott, let Scott have the... Uh, <laughs> uh, hey, now. Hey, now, even, Scott. Is, is that even right the way it's wrong? No. What's up, Scott? <laughs> Sorry to break that up, Keith. Um, you, you know who my favorite guest was? Who, Dave? When I was listening, uh, it was Stevie Wonder. And, and, you know, the other day I, I confused Stevie Wonder. I, I gave him a piece of uh, matzah to read. You gave him a piece of matzah to read? Yeah, yeah. He's having problems with that. <laughs> Say something, Howard. Yeah. And, and, Hardy, you don't get enough credit. You know, in my opinion, you'd make a great fag. Such pretty curly hair to grab onto, strong, solid hips for pumping. Kiss me, you big Zeppeli. Oh, <laughs> give me a kiss. Come oh, on. Oh, wow. Come here, you big Zeppeli. <laughs> Dave, it's theater of the mind. You don't have to go All right, really. <laughs> Did he actually grab you? Yeah, he, he was grab... reaching for it. Jesus. I'm glad to see Artie's drinking again. But <laughs> where does the funniness come from? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Try that again. Oh. No, I'm saying I, I, I'm glad to see Artie's drinking again. But but when does the funniness uh, come back? That's it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> laughing again. Uh, the, the, first, right. the first one was a bigger disaster than 911. <laughs> Take a uh, let's read slow is what I always say. Take a breath. David Letterman would like to say hi to David Letterman. David, hi. Listen, listen, yeah, go ahead, Dave. Enough with the slut. Let's talk to the cute guy. Oh, my Aunt God. Howard, d does she do uh, guys with masks? <laughs> All right. Ah. David Letterman is very, very... And, and I apologize for him. So he, if some, he's old-fashioned. He thinks a girl in porn is a slut. You're not a slut. No, I'm not. You don't just do any guy. No, absolutely not. Right. <laughs> David Letterman, please. Well, give I, him I, I, just th I just think you'll make a, a wonderful mother one day. Oh, uh, what is that? Well, that's not sarcasm, I smell it. Dude, we're having really? a sexy time. Take Say something easy. sexy, yeah, you big yeah. fool. What's the matter with you? I know you got a hit TV show, yeah. but come on. I'll put my mask on after the show. I'm sorry. No, really, what are you doing over there? <laughs> come on, I'm trying to have a good time with a girl. Dave Letterman, go ahead. Yeah, I, I just want to say, I want to ask your, your that guy, J.D., something. Hey, J.D., you want to you wanna practice tongue kissing with me? <laughs> and, you know, I have another secret I want to tell you, Howard. You know, something, sometimes I, I like to sit in a, a Port Authority bathroom. <laughs> hey, Howard, what, what, what is it? Take off your shirt for Robin. No, no, no. Let's <laughs> pull your shirt up. No. Pull your shirt up. Let's show you your belly and your boobs. Look at this. Look at this guy. Oh, don't it's suck it in. horrible, but you could. You, Whatever. You don't, bring, bring Jason Kaplan. You're a young there, man. Right? <laughs> no, you know what? Uh, get out of here.
Wow, that's hot. <laughs> Dave, you like that? That's hot, buddy. That on stupid. Jamie human just ran switch. out of the room. Well, uh. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Sweet. <laughs> Larry, you're on the air. Hey. Hey, now. Hey, now. Hey, I want to know why you have that Letterman on there. He is such a puss. I don't know. He's so incoherent. He was doing good at the beginning. Oh, stop it. Dave, it's he amazing. Was, he, was, he was good at the beginning, and then he, like, he gets all fired up, and he starts reading too fast. Howard. I guess. Nothing that he says is ever in context or has any bearing on any of the show. I mean, what's with kissing some guy in the mouth? I is mean, this Richard Christie's cousin on the phone? <laughs> no. But, it's Dave, it's Dave Letterman. <laughs> Howard, on, win on, this guy over. I Say don't something. understand oh, where you come from, moron. Yeah, all right. Howard, listen, I want to ask you something. On eh, eh, eh. Will I be able to use my mouth on you, or are you going to come up with another lame excuse? <laughs> hey, You're laughing. Way. So you You're laughing. laughing. Yeah, and by the way, Robin, tell me about slavery and your people's hard times. <laughs> oh, Lord. You, you know, in India, husbands can light their wives on fire, and we say we're the greatest country on earth. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dave Letterman, I'll see you on your show tonight. By the way, I will be on Letterman tonight, provided I can get there on time. You will be? Yeah. All right. For real, though. Well, we'll hey, see. Maybe, maybe he'll be a little bit more coherent than tonight, then, yeah, hopefully. Yeah, maybe it's a little early for him. By the way, I Howard, can, I, can I get a plug-in? Yeah. Okay, Fred, bend over. Ah. <laughs> he's, he's on a roll now. Nice. All right. All right, Rob, what else is in the news? Howard? Yes, Dave. You know that show I like on television? I, I love that show, Biggest Loser. I, I take the whole season and then watch it in reverse, and I really like to watch people, you know, destroy themselves. Get fat. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't recall writing that. Because mm -hmm. we didn't. Is he is he doing his own material now? I believe. Uh, no, no. Somebody wrote that here. No, just stick to the, what I approve. On the yeah. fly, right? Yeah, right? Who did that on the fly? That was approved. That was approved. You're kidding. Um, Big mistake. How sad. <laughs> you know, sometimes you have to read these things out loud. We did. <laughs> well, I'll tell you something else that t that ticks me off. Oh no. You know, I wonder if Martha Stewart, you know, smells okay down there because, you know, it's hard for a woman with chubby thighs to fully clean. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. All right. Yeah. What did uh, Is that in your notes? What did you say? <laughs> All right. I gotta. I, I, let's let Robin continue the news. Yes. You know, I, I, I'd pay good money to take a peek at Fred's bat wings. <laughs> uh huh. And by the way, I just found out something very disturbing. The, the Marx Brothers—they were Jewish. <laughs> Okay. Dave Letterman. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Which, which I will be watching tonight. Yeah, yeah. Looking forward to seeing Dave. Hey, you know, when I when I see Paris Hilton, I say to myself, damn, that's a waste of good vagina. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nice. Yeah. All right, thank you. Do, do you think uh, if Donald Trump uh, had his life to live over again, he'd still fall in love with himself? What do you think? <laughs> Is that right. a question I should ask tonight? All right. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dave. You know, I, I once paid a, a, a black family $75,000 to move out of my neighborhood. Really? Oh, yeah. You really want to admit to that? <laughs> and it was worth it, too. The British... <laughs> by, by the way, Howard, did you uh, see that uh, hot piece of ass in the papers last week? Who? Oh. Uh, five foot four, 175 pounds, and dynamically uh, dynamite wrapped around her, her belly. God damn it, I love an adventurous broad. What? <laughs> that, that, that woman in, in the paper last week. She was uh, from what they did terrorists to uh, try to blow herself up. Is that what he's talking about? Yeah, he's saying he was excited by it. Dynamite wrapped around her body. And I'm telling you, I love an adventurous broad. I didn't understand a word he was saying. No, Jesus Christ! Between Artie and Benji, there's there's more fat ass back here than a Weight Watchers meeting. All right, All right Dave, you you calm down now. All right. Howard, can I ask you a question? No. Is, is, is oh, all right. <laughs> is George Decay gay? I, I want to know if I should hate him or not. Dave Letterman oh, coming up. Jeez, man. Thank you very much. <laughs> Dave, I think you did enough today. I mean, all you right, really buddy. worked hard and yeah. you quit while you're ahead. Okay. You got a few laughs. Yeah. Let's end on a high note. <laughs> Try one more time. You get a big laugh. All right, let's see here. <laughs> all right, uh, you know, I was going to say that. Uh, uh, Fred, can, can you pretend that my lap is your sound effects machine and, and tap, tap, tap? <laughs> yeah, I think you did that. All right, thank you, Dave. California Bears Governor repeating. Arnold Schwarzenegger is in <laughs> China. Holy jeez. Keep your dreams. Yeah, keep your dreams. Maybe one day you'll wink up uh, white. 
What? I said keep your dreams, Arnold. Maybe no, I mean, I'm saying, I'm saying Dave. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> he, didn't, he didn't want you to repeat it. All right. Shut up. <laughs> Arnold also told the students uh, that... Howard, can I just say something? No. Yeah, all right. <laughs> well, no wonder why all the guys in the in the Middle East want to blow themselves up. The, the women are, are hideous over there. I think Ellen would be considered a supermodel in Baghdad, don't you? <laughs> That's true. See, I'm glad you said it. Yeah. It didn't matter funny. that I said that. Yeah, I'm scared, Howard. I, I think I saw a dead air Dave with a backpack. I, I, I thought they outlawed selling backpacks and, and duffel bags uh, to those people. Oh, stop it. Oh. Dead air Dave's a great guy. All right. Come on. <laughs> Howard, can I just say something? You know, every everyone is is making such a fuss about this bird flu. But personally, you know, the blacks scare me more. I, I don't cross the street when I see a bunch of sparrows. No offense, Robin. <laughs> Why are you so afraid of black people? What have black people ever done to you, I David Letterman? Really done. I don't know. Really, I mean, no, they've only been good to you, the blacks. Yeah, they have. All right. They work cheap. No, they don't. Right. You just got to be quiet. <laughs> is he a living over there? Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. All right. Anything else, Robin? Put the mask on. Uh, yes. I don't understand why atheists who don't believe in God get so upset when his name is used. Take off that map and mask and sit still. Yeah, we're doing a show, dude. El Creepo over here. <laughs> Uh, anyway, atheist Michael Nadal sued the U.S. government to have the phrase under... You know, I can't wait for that new Harry Potter movie. Uh, that, that little wizard can take a ride on my magic broomstick anytime he wants. <laughs> well, I'll be on... Is that it, Robin? That's what's oh, happening. All right. I, I, I'll be on David Letterman tonight. I'm looking forward to that, Dave. All right, buddy. Okay. And don't worry, we'll we'll take care of that uh, that, that time slot there. And Robin, I must say, I'm not normally a fan of blacks, but you, my dear, are quite a delight. <laughs> Isn't that nice? <laughs> that makes up for everything. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. You really Just forget everything else he said. You're a really great guy. And, and Howard, you know, I'm famous. When I get to do, when do I get to bang that that tasteless uh, slut Paris Hilton? That talentless slut Paris Hilton. I think. Make up your mind. Is it tasteless or talentless? Uh, talentless. Maybe it's both. Yeah. You want to try it again? All right, listen, Dave. Thank. You. Seriously, right, Dave. Buddy. Dave, the real. I mean, you're not the real David Letterman. I guess people have caught on by now. Yeah. And. Uh, but it's Dave, a pleasure to have you here. This Dave who comes in, it's a pleasure to have you here, and I want to thank you for all the great years. And uh, hopefully we'll see you on the other side as well. They're my favorite days. Yeah. When Dave Can you imagine there. him on the other side? Dave, will you be willing to work blue on the other side? Oh, sure. Oh, yeah. Let's not forget 9-1-1-1, <laughs> sure. one, 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 okay? Let's not forget that. <laughs> all right, we won't. It's an extra one in there. Let's not forget that and when he said Jennifer Acriston. Yeah. Or any of those mistakes. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow.